Believe it or not, some of the first content I ever created for this channel was centered around Brawl Stars. I'm talking way back in the day when this game was still in portrait orientation and not even globally released. But I decided to return to the game recently and I wanted to share some of the thoughts that I have with you all. Don't forget to leave a like, pop a sub, and comment down below what you think of Brawl Stars and let's get right into it. Immediately, I was blown away with how much content they've added since I played this game. There are so many brawlers, maps, game modes, and other things that have been added, and it's great to see. However, the biggest difference I've noticed right from the get-go is that there are no longer any brawl boxes. And if you guys never played Brawl Stars back in the day, brawl boxes were basically glorified loot boxes, and that's how you unlocked brawlers as well as other currencies that allowed you to level up those brawlers. And that ultimately led to me leaving this game overall. I just got so sick of relying on luck, and the progression system was not rewarding. Due to having no brawl boxes in the game anymore, the entire progression system has been reworked and there is no luck involved when it comes to unlocking brawlers or any other currencies. Everything has a clearly defined track and you know exactly what you're working towards and what you might unlock next. So you just have to play the game and achieve quests. All of these aforementioned aspects with this progression system automatically lead to a less predatory monetization system, in my opinion. So you can outright buy the brawlers that you actually want if you're too impatient to wait to unlock them on your track, or you can just focus on buying cosmetics, or you can buy the battle pass. Everything's very straightforward, buyers know exactly what they're getting, but if you don't want to spend your money, then as a free-to-play player, you will unlock everything through gameplay without a doubt. That's not to mention how different the gameplay feels too. With so many brawlers in the game now, there are so many strategies and synergies that you can have with your teammates, and it feels way more skill-based and it has way more depth than it initially had way back in the day when I played it. And I think that allows the longevity of this game to be extended, which is always good with a free-to-play game. And on top of that, you can make custom matches as well as custom maps with your friends. I feel like the social aspect of this game has been increased, and you can play with anybody and do whatever modes you want, and you can even join clans, and clans have a lot more things going for it too. So there's a lot of incentives just to play this game and keep playing it. I've also been impressed with the variety of game modes. They're all really fun, and I never dread playing a specific mode, even when it has a quest associated with it, which is a great sign. They're all fun, they're all wacky, and you never have to take it too seriously. I think Brawl Stars is a perfect example about how it's never too late to rework a game in order for it to fulfill its potential. And they really took a risk with doing this, and it paid off. Look at me, I never thought I would come back to Brawl Stars and enjoy it, but holy crap is it a different game, and for the better, and I'm playing it now. So if you guys are similar to me where you played it early on, try it out again. I think you will be shocked. This has been one of the biggest surprises in mobile gaming for me personally ever. I've never seen a game completely 180 in this direction and succeed. So it's really refreshing. I hope you guys give it a try. The link to it is in the description down below. All right, guys, I just wanted to share some of my thoughts on returning to Brawl Stars in 2023. I hope you enjoyed them. And if you did, please leave a like, pop a sub and comment down below your thoughts of Brawl Stars in 2023. Are you similar to me? I'm curious to know. I love you guys. I hope you guys are staying safe and take it easy.